What's goody everybody, Dargool here, back at it again with another video. But in today's video, everybody, we got ourselves basically something really, really fun that we're going to be doing. Because not only is it a hunt for a certain card, it is also going to be a great experience to open up another one of these boxes. And right in front of me, everybody, we got ourselves a Sun and Moon Guardians Rising fake booster box yes you heard it right this is a fake box because it does not have the seal of approval and if you guys are wondering what's the seal of approval it's basically the saran wrap or the plastic wrap has to have pokeballs all over the plastic wrap which in this case it does not but however also keep in mind that just because it has the pokeball plastic wrap does not make it automatically real because there are some fake booster boxes out there that actually have the pokeball on the plastic wrap but it's not real in its entirety so guys we're gonna be opening up this box however we're gonna be looking for one card and that is the tapu lele is it right here yep it's right here guys tapu lele gx if you guys don't know what that card is i will be putting it on the screen right here just so you guys know what is that card who is that pokemon and so forth so without further ado guys we're basically gonna see how many tapu leles can we get in a fake booster box another little small challenge if you want to do this one yourselves you can count up how many ultra rares did we get from this fake box and let me know in the comments down below because i'm not going to keep track on how many ultra rares we get because our main focus is going to be on that tapu lele you feel me so i'm gonna keep track of the tapu leles if you guys want you can keep track of the ultra rares but i'm not gonna keep track of all of that with that being said everybody if you guys are excited for today's video go ahead and smash that like button turn on that bell for post notifications and make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and welcome to the ghoul army if you guys want to support the channel there is a bunch of links in the description down below just in case you guys want to help out the channel and support it basically but guys i'm also going to be revamping discord if you guys are not aware we do have a discord channel however it's been falling out a little bit and i'm going to be adding a bunch of exciting new features on our discord channel it's not just mine it's ours the ghoul army the pokemon community anybody can join it's in the description down below guys if you guys do want to join talk to me talk to other fans and other people that love and enjoy pokemon just as much as you do everybody so without further ado i'm gonna go ahead and get right into this box take off the plastic and we're gonna see how this goes man so like i said this plastic it feels cheap and if you guys are curious how much i bought this box for i bought it for 16 dollars if you can ever grab a guardians rising box for 16 dollars you hit a gold mine you literally hit a gold mine because y'all already know guardians rising has like one of the most expensive now i'm talking expensive pokemon cards within you feel me because most of the cards are one playable and two they're just all out amazing but honestly the playable cards is what has the value around pokemon cards unless it's like a really collectible card old school vintage you know stuff like that then it'll have value so first thing we notice the packs are put in the wrong way like they're sideways they're supposed to be facing front towards me but i guess they wanted to put these packs sideways i don't know why they do that but i don't know what goes through their heads honestly i don't know what goes through their heads so let's take out a couple packs right here guys as you can see guardians rising right here man they feel so thin like they feel so thin the pack like look at these cards they bend so easy guys so we got a ton of packs right here to open up. We got Lycanroc, we got Komo'o, we got Tapu Koko, and then we have Alolan Ninetales. Instead of Tapu Koko, they should have put Tapu Lele, because Tapu Lele is like the most popular card from Guardians Rising, hands down. So we're just going to go ahead and take a huge stack. Actually, let's leave all those. And we're going to start with this stack right here, and let's just go ahead and let the challenge begin, and let's find out how many Tapu Lele's can we find and if you guys want to do the additional challenge how many ultra rares can we get so let's go ahead and start with the first pack right here featuring alola ninetales oh my god don't tell me these are like super glued yo that was so hard to open up that was so hard to open up but we got a dark ride gx from burning shadows so already right off the bat 
these are wrong and then we got some generic fake cards right here guys you know these are just some very very thin cards i'm talking like ultimate thin guys check that out let me get a regular card right here they don't bend that easy but this one it like goes oh my gosh like that is just absolutely crazy and i'm sorry acerola i did not mean to hurt you like that but you know after this i'm gonna take you out to lunch you know we can get some spaghetti or we can go to starbucks i already know how you white girl okay i'm gonna stop i'm gonna stop i am just gonna stop right there so first pack we got one ultra rare don't tell me it's like one ultra rare per pack that would be pretty pretty lame so we got a beware gx which is a promo card so kind of weird seeing that in an actual pack honestly so we got psychic memory we got yo we got a quick little miscut right there sea of nothingness but you know it's just a slight miscut which is worth nothingness get it get it no no okay i'm gonna stop but let's keep on going guys if i'm correct if these have one ultra rare per pack then that means that we are literally only oh there goes the ultra rare of course all right guys it was a good ultra rare it was literally a charizard gx full art that fell to the floor so that's definitely going to the highlights because that is a beautiful card you feel me so it looks like there's only one ultra rare per pack so that means there's only gonna be 36 ultra rares out of every single pack that's kind of disappointing Ooh, miss magius i did not know that was in this set okay never mind there's cards all oh my god that is probably one of the worst miscut cards I've ever seen. Is it the same height of a Pokemon card? No, it's not. They just cut this Pokemon card wrong. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. We got... Oh my god, I gotta save that. I gotta save that because that looks ridiculous. Talk about standards, my boy. Talk about standards. So let's keep on going, guys. We got another set. We keep getting those psychic memories. We got an Alolan Muck full art right there. Honestly, if we don't get any Tapu Lele, I'm going to look ridiculous opening this up. Like, I'm going to look absolutely ridiculous, guys. So next up, we got a Tapu Bullet. We are hitting the Full Arts and the Secret Rares pretty hard, honestly. But we want them Tapu Leles. We don't want them Tapu Bolus or those Tapu Cocos. We want them Tapu Leles. You feel me? Alolan Muck once again. Alolan Muck, why do you keep following me? I don't like you as a Pokemon or... Well, I do love the original form. Oh my god, this pack is literally like peeling off. That's so, so terrible and unsatisfying to open up. I hate when packs take long to open up, but let's keep on looking. Let's see what this is. Primarina. GX, full art from Sun and Moon Base. Not even from Guardians Rising. That card was from Sun and Moon base set. Alrighty, guys. Alrighty. Right, we keep getting the same freaking commons and uncommons. We got a Darkrai GX full art. Come on. Can there at least be one Tapu Lele in this box? Please, just one. Oh my god, these cards are upside down. That's interesting. That is interesting. Ho-Oh GX. That is a beautiful card, but it's not a Tapu Lele, so I'm sorry, Ho-Oh. You're not getting the spotlight for this video because we have one mission and that mission is to find the Tapu freaking Lele. And then, ooh! I've never, ever, ever held this card on my hands like this. I know it's fake. I know it's fake. I know it's fake, but this card is beautiful. I wish I had a real one. We might have to open up some more Shining Legends, honestly, because I want this card. I really want that card. That card is beautiful. That card is life. And this pack does not, look at this. Look at this. There's literally a force field <laughs> on this pack. And I think we already saw the Ultra. I believe it's a Charizard Full Art. Nope. It's an Incineroar Full Art, which is even worse because who wants Incineroar Full Art? Bro, how many packs are in this box? It feels like it is way more than 36, but come on. They are opening up so terrible. We got an Umbreon Jack. Should we even look at the uncommons and commons? Because I feel like there's nothing interesting in those uncommons and commons bro like there is absolutely nothing look at these like nothing no misspells discoloration a little bit on this emolga it's like kind of green and yellow but that's pretty much it you know like slight discoloration and then we got a horrible looking noivern full art because i don't think it looks like that on the regular full art that looks kind of freaky honestly we got a ton of full arts but so far we have zero tapu lele gx cards which is like bro where are 
the Tapu Lele GX. Like, we're getting so many ultra rares, but... Oh, my God! We recently got this card from a... Uh, what is it? What is it? 100 ultra rare box? GX box? This card is beautiful. That card is absolutely beautiful. I just love the way it looks, honestly. Like, a gold... Is it Lima? I'm pretty sure it's Lima. Lima? Lima. I'm pretty sure it's Lima. So, like I said, man, these uncommons, commons, they're not even worth looking. Oh, my God. Speaking of the beautiful cards, bro, look at this Lily. We got Lily, guys. That is wild. That is wild. These fake cards are wildin', bro. They are just absolutely crazy. They're beautiful, honestly. I really love them. And then we got another freaking Lima right here, guys. Three gold cards in a row. That's like the best box ever. Even though that gold card does not... Lily is not even a gold card. So these are basically like some really bad fakes. We got a Machamp GX. Nobody wants those blessed Machamp pulls, bro. Like nobody, nobody wants those. So we got more booster packs left. Let me count up real quick how many we have. So we got 18 booster packs. Weirdly enough, we literally grabbed half of the packs without even counting in the beginning. Like... What are the odds of that happening? But guys, we are only going to look at the ultras from now on because I don't want to make this video extremely, extremely long. And we only have one purpose for this video anyways. And that's literally to find the Tapu Lele GX card. And we got Thick Wick as we open up this pack. Look at Okay, I'm going to stop. I was about to say something else, but... Every time I get that card and that trainer in general... I don't know, that card, the trainer... It's life. It is life. If you want to know the meaning of life, just get yourself a thicken full art lily. I know I didn't say a word earlier. I said thicken because I was about to say thick, but then I said frickin' because I got this lily, but I was going to say thick because I got this wick and I don't know what else I'm saying. So we're just going to keep on going and we're going to keep on rolling. I don't know what I'm talking about. We got a freaking full art gold lily card. Now we have two. Now we have... Why do I keep putting the uncommons right here? Now we have two gold lilies, everybody. What are the odds of getting that, bro? That's just amazing. That is just absolutely amazing. As we get a Salazzle... Well, I swear, we got like 5 million psychic memories. If I get one more psychic memory, I'm gonna rip it. I'm just definitely, definitely going to rip that card because I'm just tired of seeing it. We got an Espeon GX... Come on, we are literally getting, like, brand new ultra rares, like, a ton of ultra rares. We're not even getting that many duplicates on freaking GX cards, but we haven't even got one freaking Tapu Lele, everybody. We don't even have one Tapu. We did get a Luzumine. Shouts out to Luzumine for being Lily's mom. You're both beautiful. We got a Kawaii full art right there. Why do they keep making my boy silver and then all the other trainers get gold? I mean, that's just a little sus. You feel me? That is a little sus. So let's go ahead and open up these next packs, these next remaining packs, as we get a gold nest ball. As we get a gold nest ball, bro. Like, that is just crazy. That is just crazy. However, we got another Neuburn. Another Neuburn. I don't even want to look at these commons and uncommons, bro, because there is just absolutely no reason to look at those uncommons and common cards. And we keep getting duplicates, man. We did get another losing me, but I don't care about that. Where are the Tapu Leles? I'm opening these packs up like a monster right now. I wouldn't open up normal packs like this because, you know... Oh, I don't think I've seen... Okay, this is a promo. This is a promo. I was about to say, I don't think I've seen that card before, but I remember it's a Team Skull promo. Guys, these packs are literally hurting my hands. We got an Umbria. I don't care about those. Where are the Tapu Leles? Where are the Tapu Leles? All I wanted in life. It's just one to Ooh, I mean, I'll take an Ultra Ball. I'm not even gonna lie. Yo, I'm fake for that. I'm fake for that. I'm over here crying and moping for Tapu Lele. But then when I get an Ultra Ball, I automatically switch up. Because, you know, that Ultra Ball holds more value than Tapu Lele. So, hands down, I'm gonna want that Ultra Ball. You feel me? So, I'm gonna stop being fake. And we're gonna go back to... Ooh, I'm gonna keep being fake. I'm gonna keep being... No, way, no. I'm gonna stop being fake. I don't care about you, Sogaleo. I only care about my Lily. Or not freaking Lily. Tapu Lele. Oh my god. Tapu Lele and Lily. I mean, they're kind of similar. They're pretty much the same. As we get our third Tapu Bulu. We're getting Tapu Bulu. We're getting Tapu Coco. 
but we're not getting a Tapu Lele. We got a Decidueye Full Art, though. We got how many packs? We got three packs left, and we didn't even get one Lily. That is just disappointing right there. That, oh my god, this pack doesn't want to... Dude, after this, I'm done buying these booster boxes because these packs are literally making my hands red. And, oh my god, they're just making me hate opening up freaking packs. Except when i get a full art lily i absolutely love opening up these packs that is our third one guys ladies and gentlemen that is our third oh my god see i hate this pack look at this just look at this look at this man look how i'm opening up this pack as our final card is not a tapu lele our final card is a dark ride gx we got 36 ultra rares out of 36 packs guys that's crazy that is like an insane ratio but we didn't even get one tapu lele so in my book we failed like we automatically failed because i thought we were gonna get at least maybe five tapu leles i thought this was gonna follow the cards of guardians rising and there was gonna be like four ultra rares per pack but that was not the case everybody however we did get some amazing amazing cards we did get all of these i mean minus thick wick we did get all of these gold cards right here bro because these are just absolutely amazing we got three lily two lima and then we got some balls right here pause on that pause pause on that guys get your mind out of the gutter bro we got a full art mewtwo or a texture mewtwo gx we got a full art rainbow rare raichu full art charizard and then we got the best card ever mystic wick you feel me so without further ado guys if you did enjoy this video i know we got zero tapu leles however you guys were still able to do the other challenge even though it was self-explanatory which means we only got 36 ultra rares without further ado guys maybe next time we'll get them tapu leles in some real packs so there's another hint that a challenge is coming soon without further ado i'm gonna go ahead and end the video right here and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace